Fuck. Yeah. Yeah, fuck yeah. You can combine the two words if you don't know what they mean. Anyways. Yeah, explaining this. This is uh, <laughs> the world's hardest game. I just decided to record it. There is volume that goes with it. I was deciding to just rage over this, like, a month old, this video. And I'm, I'm putting this instead of Call of Duty because... I'm not uploading a single Black Ops 2 video ever again. Ever. Ever. As soon as GTA, which this is my review of GTA and where I've been. I don't know. People want to know where I've been. I just haven't been on. Well, actually, I haven't been on anything but GTA, which is, and then Rock Band. But still, uh, what was I saying? Yeah, this will be my review of GTA and uh, catch up of what is happening. What's happening? So this is the day before the multiplayer initiates for, I, I don't know, Xbox and PS3? I don't know. Probably both. Fuck knows. All I care about is Xbox. I don't give a shit about anything else. I, did this game even come out on PS3? Not not the world's hardest game. Not not, not PS3. PC. Because I'm pretty sure, uh, man, look at me dying. I'm such a fucking beast. Jesus Christ. Ugh. Whatever. Uh... What else was there to say? I mean, there's there's nothing much to say other than you will never see me commentate or upload another Black Ops 2 gameplay ever again. I mean, I will do Ghosts, sure, I'll do Ghosts, but you'll never see me doing Black Ops 2. Just, the game is trash. As soon as uh, GTA came out, oh my god, best fucking game ever, ever! Well, actually, it, it's in my top three, I don't, I'm not going to say it off the top of my head, but it is, it just, oh... It, it did amazing first day. I mean, for if you haven't uh, seen on the news how good that fucking did. Oh, whoo, whoo. I mean, I was looking at the pre-ordering things and pre-orders things were off the chart. I don't know how long this is. And uh, okay, let's get this fine and clear. I, I feel like I'm not getting the point down. No more fucking call a do date. Okay, no more. I mean, Black Ops Two, Call of Duty, you know, COD Ghost that will. Uh, that's in a month and a few days, right? November 2nd? Is that when it comes out? I don't know. I don't know when it comes... Yeah, November 2nd on a Tuesday. I don't know. When the Tuesday is fucking November. I'm not here to judge when the game comes out, because I could care less, really. Once GTA comes out, once multiplayer comes out, the sun will be irrelevant. I mean, I, I still see some people who haven't bought the game, and, you know, instead of playing, like, GTA 4 or something, and buying, like, a cheaper version, let's say used... They're playing COD. Are you fucking for real? You're playing COD when GTA just came out. Now, there is no way to support an answer that says GTA is bad. And honestly, if you don't like it, you've got some serious social issues. And honestly, if, if you haven't played it yet, and let's say you, you can't afford it, that's okay. But don't play COD. Don't play COD. Just don't. The, the game is such a fucking epitome of shit. Maybe if it were made by Treyarch, it'd be better, but... Oh, man, GTA. Let's, let's, uh... This, the sad thing is, some channels still are uploading Call of Duty, even after GTA came out, the day of. Oh, do you, do you need help? Like, you're uploading Call of Duty the day after GTA come out. I mean, some of these channels haven't even uploaded GTA yet. My valid excuse is, A, no one is, no one has the intelligence to think, hey, hey, I have some interesting... GTA gameplay. Here, take it. No, no one no one I know has that kind of intelligence, which I've been wanting, but I, I don't ask. I just... I infer. I infer that somebody actually has an IQ over 100, which it, apparently no one else fucking does. But anyways. And second, you're still uploading fucking Call of Duty. Are you, are you kidding? And, and not only Call of Duty, you know, I see Drifter, he's uploading, like, let's say, tips and tricks, which, honestly, at this point of the game, come on. No more tricks and trips. Trip tricks and whatever. Whatever. Other guys too, you know. Even, there shouldn't be any information on anything Call of Duty while GTA just came out. It, it just shouldn't. This game shouldn't even, met, uh, Call of Duty shouldn't even be fucking mentioned. Except, it sucks dick. There you go. Let's see. Let's get the review going. The game, oh, I got, I got a cold by the way. I got something. I don't know what it is. The game is sheer biblicity. I mean, if you don't, if you if you don't feel me on that one, if you haven't played it yet, seriously, I mean, if you can't afford it, that's one thing. 
if you don't have an Xbox or something, if you don't have a console, that, that's another thing. But, if you have a console, you can afford it, and you don't have it, seriously, you're gonna fucking die. If, if I don't even know. I don't know. The, the game is perfect. Everything is, is just, oh, the campaign, it felt too short. I mean, sure, it took me like eight days to beat it, because, I don't know, it just felt slow when I was playing it, and, uh, I mean, the campaign's amazing. The three characters, Trevor, he's the best, easy. Best and most entertaining to watch. You got Mike, you know, he's in the middle. I play as him most, just because I feel like he's, like, the, you know, the most easy character to play as, and then there's Franklin. You know, it's just Franklin. Who the fuck gives a shit about Franklin? Uh, I mean, the supporting characters are really good. These characters, I mean, these characters, you know, they're impactful. I mean, they're not Master Chief and fucking Mario impactful, but, you know, I, I don't know. Would they these be more impactful than Nico from uh, GTA 4? I don't know. You know, that was one guy opposed to three, and they did really get the personalities perfect. I mean, Trevor, I, I just love him. He's not as ruthless as he should be, but he he's there, you know. I mean, this is, yeah, the supporting characters, fuck. Yes, they're just great. I mean, you know, when you have dumbass Lamar, which I honestly know someone who sounds exactly like him, might have a little bit lower IQ, but uh, it's, it's, it's honestly like you could just relate to him by looking at this guy and relate. It's just the funniest fucking thing ever. And I mean, he's entertaining. The bitch stretch, though. I'm glad. I'm glad. If you haven't beat the game by now, seriously, just get some more time in there and beat it. Free mode is not as fun as it would be online, but it, it's still fun. Uh, what other supporting characters are there? There's, uh, Mike's family, which are absolute cunts. I honestly want to burn down my house with all of them inside. Jim's a fucking cunt. I thought he was Jonah Hill at first, honestly, the voice. I mean, the, the appearance is slightly, yeah, but... It's, it's the funny fact that they try to make him a, a gangster. Yo, it's Jizzle. Jizzle, yeah. Oh my god, it's just funny as fuck. I mean, the game just operates so well. What other characters are there? Uh... Ah, shit, let's, let's look on Trevor's side. You got Ron. Ron's like some cigarette smoker. He just sounds like it. Wade. Wade is the fun... Oh, my God. That's just perfect. The way they have Wade. Hi, Wade. I mean, it's, it's, it makes... This game is... It just makes fun of every aspect of social life. I mean, it, it just targets it in a subliminal way and makes fun... I just love it. I love it. Anything that you can critique about life is it's just great. I mean, the missions are fun. There is... It very feels like, very rarely feels like there's missions that actually repeat itself. You know, it's, it's just so solid. It, it's great. I mean, there's, it's hard to say different. It's, uh, what, what, what else? You know, I mean, you got Lloyd, which is like a more intelligent Wade, but I, that's it for supporting characters, except for uh, the antagonists or Dave Norton, whatever. Let's see, what else we got? The aspects, the driving aspects. Fucking amazing. Are you kidding? The handling lines in this game. Apart from GTA 4, where your cars would literally, it was like driving on ice. Oh, shit. It, it was driving on ice. The brakes, the brakes wouldn't fucking work. It, it, it's like skidding on a field of dildos. You, you just, you, you just couldn't get anywhere. I mean, you would go, let's say, 150 miles per hour and brake. You'd be breaking down the whole street. The only aspect I don't like is, I feel like in this game, you die quick as hell. Oh, my God. Yeah, you're dead in five shots. But they do have a tank, and that prevents my death very quickly. Although, the thing with the tank is, uh, it, it, ah, fuck. If you run over a vehicle, let's say, at the wrong angle, and it explodes, like, by the engine part of the tank, which is in the back, the tank will blow up. That's the only weakness of the tank that I've identified. I'm sure you could shoot it with stuff, but I don't know that. I, it, multiplayer is the only way to really test these theories. Or go to the military base and get absolutely butt-touched. Uh, I did steal the jet. The jet was awesome. I mean, that thing is just so fun to drive. It stalled out and just crashed into the floor, but it was still awesome to drive while I had it. Honestly, I wish it went way faster. I'm pretty sure it tops out at like 400 miles per hour. I don't know. Those jets are supposed to go 1,000, and that'd be fun as hell. Just going, woo, woo, back and forth, you know. Uh, I mean, I'm just I'm just crashing planes into the ground and stuff. I'm sure that's not how they're supposed to be flown, but you know, it's it's fun. It's great. The game is great. The guns, the minigun. Oh, the minigun. Too bad there's no aim assist with the minigun. Aim assist is brilliant. You uh shoot, kill a guy. As long as you still have aim assist on him, you can just move over, take out another guy. It's great. Uh, what else is there? 
There's no Call of Duty related things in it at all. Thank God. Oh, that's beautiful. Uh, the planes, yeah, they're fun. Helicopters, eh, yeah. They could have added more helicopters. I mean, uh, the Annihilator, that's probably only a multiplayer, which is quite sad, but, you know, it, it, it is what it is. Uh, what else is there to it? I mean, there's so many aspects that only I could label them when I see them. Now, uh, I'll finish this tomorrow or something. I don't know. I don't know. See you later.